Dive into the ultimate Bible quiz challenge. Join us for an exciting quiz that will put your biblical knowledge to the test. Get ready for a fun and educational journey through the scriptures. Don't forget to subscribe for more. Question 1. Why did Pharaoh's daughter name the child Moses? The answer is she drew him out of the water, and the child grew, and she brought him unto Pharaoh's daughter, and he became her son. And she called his name, Moses, and she said, Because I drew him out of the water. Exodus 2 verse 10 Question 2. Who was the Jewish magician sorcerer in the book of Acts? The answer is Bar Jesus, and when they had gone through the island to Paphos, they found a certain sorcerer, a false prophet, a Jew, whose name was Bar Jesus, Acts 13 verse 6. Question 3. Which man was plowing his field when he was called to be a prophet of God? The answer is Elisha, so he departed thence, and found Elisha the son of Shaphat, who was plowing with twelve yoke of oxen before him, and he with the twelfth, and Elijah passed by him, and cast his mantle upon him. 1 Kings 19 verse 19. Question 4. How many of the healed ten lepers returned to thank Jesus? The answer is, one, one of them, when he saw he was healed, came back praising Video. God in a loud voice. He threw himself at Jesus' feet and thanked him, and he was a Samaritan. Luke 17 verses 15 to 16. Question 5. Andrew and which other disciple asked Jesus about the signs of the end times? The answer is, Peter, James, John and, Andrew. And as he sat upon the Mount of Olives over against the temple, Peter and James and John and Andrew asked him privately, Mark 13 verse 3. Question 6. Who laid his hands on Saul Paul to restore his sight? The answer is Ananias, and Ananias went his way, and entered into the house, and putting his hands on him said, Brother Saul, the Lord, even Jesus, that appeared unto thee in the way as thou camest, hath sent me, that thou mightest receive thy sight, and be filled with the Holy Ghost. Acts 9 verse 17. Question 7. How did for men carrying a paralytic bring him to Jesus? The answer is through the roof, and they come unto him, bringing one sick of the palsy, which was born of four. And when they could not come nigh unto him for the press, they uncovered the roof where he was, and when they had broken it up, they let down the bed wherein the sick of the palsy lay. Mark 2 verses 3 to 4. Question 8. In the parable of the talents, what did the servant do with his one talent? The answer is hid it, and I was afraid, and went and hid thy talent in the earth, lo, there thou hast that is thine. Matthew 25 verse 25. Question 9. Who was the youngest son of Jesse anointed by Samuel to be king?
The answer is, David. And he sent, and brought him in. Now he was ruddy, and with all of a beautiful countenance, and goodly to look to. And the Lord said, Arise, anoint him, for this is he. Then Samuel took the horn of oil, and anointed him in the midst of his brethren, and the Spirit of the Lord came upon David from that day forward. So Samuel rose up, and went to Ramah. 1 Samuel 16 verses 12 to 13. Question 10. In Paul's letters, which group is described as having a zeal for God, but not according to knowledge? <coughs> The answer is the Israelites, for I bear them record that they have a zeal of God, but not according to knowledge. Romans 10 verse 2. Question 11. Who used a stone as a pillow? The answer is Jacob, and Isaac called Jacob, and blessed him, and charged him, and said unto him, Thou shalt not take a wife of the daughters of Canaan. Genesis 28 verse 1. Question 12. On what did the apostles receive the Holy Spirit? The answer is, Day of Pentecost, when the Day of Pentecost arrived, they were all together in one place. And suddenly there came from heaven a sound like a mighty rushing wind, and it filled the entire house where they were sitting. And divided tongues as a fire appeared to them and rested on each one of them. And they were all filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak in other tongues as the Spirit gave them utterance. Acts 2 verses 1 to 4. Question 13. Who was the first person to die according to the book of Genesis? The answer is, Abel. And Cain talked with Abel his brother, and it came to pass, when they were in the field, that Cain rose up against Abel his brother, and slew him. Genesis for verse 8. Question 14. In which city did a silversmith called Demetrius gather people to riot against Paul? The answer is Ephesus, for a certain man named Demetrius, a silversmith, which made silver shrines for Diana brought no small gain unto the craftsmen, whom he called together with the workmen of like occupation, and said, Sirs, ye know that by this craft we have our wealth. Moreover ye see and hear, that not alone at Ephesus, but almost throughout all Asia, this Paul hath persuaded and turned away much people, saying that they be no gods, which are made with hands. Acts 19 verses 24 to 26. Kindly let us know how many questions you got right in the comment section below. And also, we respectfully request that you support us by subscribing to our channel and hitting the like button. Your assistance enables us to share the gospel further. See you guys in our next video.